sea saga in the Straits. I had friends that babysat an island off Skyline Marina in Atticordis. It was two miles across the shipping canal channel to Burroughs Bay. You could see San Juan Islands right across the water. Several Delta airline pilots bought the island and tried to sell vacation lots. They built a huge three-bedroom log house that was run by a generator. They also leveled a flat spot for landing small aircraft and Doug had to keep it uh, keep the tires painted white so they could land in the fog. So I would go up there on my days off when they got bored and I would take care of their dogs while they spent a couple days in town going to dinner and movies and so on. I decided I needed a boat so I could go fishing. So I bought a 10-foot aluminum boat and a three-horsepower motor. Dragged it up there in my old pickup truck. You can actually see the the uh, cement through the floorboards and um, and Doug says when I take it out to not go around the tip of the island because of the current so I'd stay in front of the island so what I did I would start the motor motor up and then cut the motor drift back and fish and I do that all day long well once I got up there and I pulled the motor this rope broke in my hand and I drifted out immediately. I was so afraid. And I panicked. And I started rowing like crazy. As I, but I was drifting faster than I was rowing. I got blisters in the palm of my hands. And then they broke and started bleeding. And then I realized the metal oar locks were cutting into the wooden oars. And were about to cut the oars in half. I started crying. I wet my pants. I dislocated my shoulder. I did make it back to shore, but I was a complete mess and told Doug to sell that blankety blank boat because I never wanted to see it again. The end of the story was the pilots only sold one lot because it is only sunny for two weeks out of the year in the Straits. Otherwise, it was windy and cold. So it was fun, fun couple of years to go visiting, but uh, I never went fishing again. <laughs>